I write you this letter on World Press Freedom Day from my cell after 126 days of incarceration for doing nothing more than the job I love. To silence me and my colleagues on the pretext that we're a threat to national security and members of a terrorist organization is a sheer insult to the intelligence of Egyptian people and the democracy promoted in the newly ratified constitution. During the previous court hearing, I stood provoked in the cage as I watched the all too familiar press pack being expelled from the court. One diligent reporter yelled a question to me on his way out. Are the hunger strikes real? Yes, the dozens of prisoners enduring weeks of genuine life-threatening hunger strikes are noble men who have no other way to contest the ill treatment they face in prison. Among those freedom fighters is Abdullah El Shami, the Al Jazeera Arabic correspondent who has been on hunger strike for weeks and lost more than 30 kilograms. His detention for almost nine months without even standing trial is a breach of human rights. I see no better occasion than today to remind the world about the plight of these men and that there are dozens of respected local Egyptian reporters and citizen journalists who are suffering in prison awaiting trial. Journalism is not a crime. They are simply prisoners of conscience. The world will be watching closely.